Tougher street vending rules could be coming to Anaheim. The city council meeting right now to discuss a new rule that would impound vendors' equipment if they break the rules. NBC 4 is Tracy Leong live right now in Anaheim with more for us on that. Tracy. Yeah, Colleen, the meeting started around 5 tonight. They plan to hear those recommendations within the next hour. Now, the biggest update tonight is that the city of Anaheim will now have the ability to impound equipment and food on their own. Anaheim has seen a significant increase in street vendors over the past several years, but nearly all of them are operating illegally. According to a staff report, there are only five flower vendors and zero food vendors that have sidewalk vendor permits in the city. Anaheim officials say this is a huge public safety concern. We have seen cases where raw meat is being left out in the sun or it's in a open cardboard box left on the ground waiting to be cooked and then ultimately sold. We've had residents call us and tell us that they bought food from a vendor and then a family member got very, very sick. Anaheim City Council is looking to update the current sidewalk vendor ordinance that was adopted in 2018 to enforce rules that could include proper disposal of food waste, prohibit vendor equipment that blocks sidewalks that violate ADA regulations. Remove Sometimes we only make 50 bucks in a day and you expect us to pay 170. His family has a flower vendor and a food vendor and don't see the benefits of getting permits to operate their business. The flowers, they're important to my mom and the food, it would be important to my dad because, you know, me and my dad, we like cooking and we feel like it should be shared with everyone. It's difficult and tiring, but at the end of the day, it's, it's a good thing to see people smile and have them happy that whatever they got, whether it be flowers or food. And Colleen, if tonight's proposals are approved, they could go into effect as early as the end of March. Reporting live in Anaheim, Tracy Leong, NBC4 News.